What is up, everybody? Ron Blue back again with another video for you guys. Excuse my voice. I'm a little under the weather, but I'm pushing through to give you guys a very, very easy song to learn. It is a song called 16 Carriages by Beyonce. This guitar work in the actual song was done by Justice West. He's a phenomenal guitarist. Check him out. Um, he's all over YouTube, but anyway, we're going to jump right into this. We're going to do a playthrough first, and then we're going to break down all the chords. It's literally two chords with an additional chord towards the bridge, but without further ado, let's just jump right into it. <laughs> two chords guys so we're gonna just jump right into the first chord and that's gonna be that C sharp major chord what you're gonna do is use your index finger bar from the fifth string down on the fourth fret then you're gonna use your ring finger bar from that fourth string down on the sixth fret and you have that C sharp major chord right let me just so you guys can see it better right now the next chord is literally a very very simple one it is a a flat major chord what you're going to do is bar from the sixth string all the way down on the fourth fret you're going to use your middle finger and put that on the fifth fret of the g string then you're going to use your ring finger, put that on the 6th fret of the A string. Your pinky is right behind it um, on the same fret, so that 6th fret, uh, but on the D string. So we have... <clears throat> right? So now, let's talk about the placement because that is extremely important for this particular song. Um, I'm gonna just give you guys an example. The rest note is really what's important that makes this song all the difference, essentially. So we're gonna jump right into it. This is right before we get into the chords. So instead of going into the it goes it you you have a one rest note in between the 16 characters so instead of going landing right into that 16 actually hit that second chord it should it should be into instead of the top of the 16 I'm talking about the the, the literally the lyric so when instead of it going uh, Six, 16 carriages. it goes 16 carriages. right so Instead of going 16 carriages and you're already or 16 and you're already at that chord so it's it's a little little tricky honestly and that's really you can get away with both because it's not like you're gonna be in a different key but if you want to match it right up to what the guitarist Justice West is doing it is literally you have to keep that rest note in there um, and then I think that also will help you as well, keeping up with um, moving forward with just tempos. Um, 
It's going to keep you updated with tempos, beats per minute. Um, I think it will help you in the long run, actually, as far as even like the counts. Um, so 16. <laughs> into is that F uh, that's that F major chord and it's literally the same chord shape as that A flat uh, A flat major chord all we're doing is bringing everything up to uh, to the two uh, the second fret right so your index finger is now going to be on the second fret you're barring that all the way down at your middle finger ring finger and uh, pinky just goes up right so back to the one actually learn the chords, learn the placement, we're going to learn some strumming techniques. <clears throat> um, so there's a few ways to go about this. For me, personally, um, I feel like strumming it is probably the best way to go about this. It's just fuller. Um, it adds on to what, you know, Beyonce is singing. Uh, but you can also strum it too, so. also going to have a link in the description of the guitar cover that I did <clears throat> to their song. So be sure to check that out as well. Subscribe. This is the only channel where you're going to be getting videos like this. Uh, guitar covers, uh, unboxings, reactions, and so much more. Until next time, peace.